Investigators in Chattanooga, Tennessee, are trying to figure out why a gunman attacked two U.S. military sites. The gunman killed four U.S. Marines before he was shot dead, apparently by police. Our nation mourns the loss, the census loss of four of our nation's heroes. The FBI says it's examining everything about the gunman, identified as Kuwait-born 24-year-old Mohammed Youssef Abdul Aziz. It says it's found no sign that he was connected to international terrorism or that he had help. There's no indication at this point that anybody else was involved. Police say Abdul Aziz first attacked a recruiting center on Thursday morning, firing from inside his car. He took a shot and then it was a pause for about two seconds and then it was just shot, 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 shot. The gunman then he drove about seven miles, attacking the Navy Marine Training Center, getting out of his vehicle and killing the four Marines before he was killed. One Marine and one police officer were wounded. Abdul Aziz lived in Hickson, a short distance from Chattanooga. Police swarmed the town. We are checking every possible place that he could reside or could have resided, visited, uh, where he shopped, where he went to school, uh, who his friends were, if he worked out at a gym. At least two women were seen in handcuffs being led away from what was believed to be Abdul Aziz's house. However, the FBI says it typically secures a scene when it's in investigating. Violet Ikonomova, The Associated Press.